Hi, I'm Rue from mummyfour.com. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is an Amazon haul of basically all the stuff that I have been buying on Amazon lately. It's a highly requested video, so I thought I would film it today. If you are new here, welcome. Please subscribe, hit the bell to be notified when I post new videos every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday at 7 p.m. I do loads of shop with me videos, hauls, speed cleans, as well as parenting tips, tricks, hacks, and advice to make your life easier. First purchase I'm going to talk to you about today is actually a rebuy for me. This is something that I discovered about a year ago and I would not be without. These are called Friction. I'm pretty sure that's how you say it. It's spelled Frix with an X-I-O-N. Um, erasable pens and these things have been a game changer for me. I did not even know about erasable pens until my mid-30s, which, you know, it's far too old to discover these things. They are amazing. I am I'm a little bit type A and I don't like messes like written in my journals and planners and things. So these solve the problem. One end is just like a normal pen and then the other end rubs it out just as if it was a pencil. Um, so they write beautifully. Um, my handwriting looks quite nice in them and obviously I can rub it out if I make mistakes or make changes to my like daily plan or anything and it all still looks neat and tidy so therefore I'm happy. I bought these before so I re-bought because some of them were running out. I re-bought these. I bought a pack of five and um, these pens as well as everything else that I am mentioning in this video are linked below. My next purchase is something I've been looking for for a while. Um, I have been I've gone through various phases of how much makeup I do and do not wear and since I've had my I mean my they need doing again I don't know if you can see I've had like I have like eyelash um extensions put in which um I have put in every few weeks and then I don't have to wear any mascara at all so before that I used to wear more makeup more eye makeup and things eyeliner and since I've had these eyelashes I just don't bother with any eye makeup um and so I feel like I don't really need like a heavy foundation but I've got super dry skin and especially in the winter I go a little bit blotchy so I wanted a nice BB cream so I heard about this one, which is the Burt's Bees BB cream. And if I'm honest, the thing that I fancied about it is someone said that it smelled like chocolate orange, which I must admit, it kind of does. So I wanted something, a BB cream, if you're not familiar, is basically from what I can gather, like everything in one. So it's just a little bit of moisture, a little bit of sun protection, a little bit of just glowy, even your skin out. And that's all I wanted is something that's, a bit more than putting on a moisturiser, but not as much as makeup. So I got this. It's always a bit of a risk, isn't it, buying stuff like this online because you can't test it and play with it, but they didn't have it in any local shops anyway, so I gave it a go. And I kind of love it. I mean, like that's all I've got on my skin. Other than, I think I just, I did put, just before I filmed, I did put a little bit of lipstick on. But other than that, that is the only thing on my face. I could probably do with covering up this spot here, if I could be bothered, but the BB cream does kind of even it all in. And my skin's not, let's say it's super dry. It's not like super, super even without anything on it. So all in all, I'm quite pleased with my BB cream purchase. If you are looking for a nice BB cream, would recommend. The next product I've bought that I'm going to talk to you about is a highlighting under eye concealer thing. Now, I'm not actually wearing this at the moment, but I will put it on in a second just to show you. The idea of this is for when perhaps my skin is worse and I really can't be bothered to wear full makeup, but maybe BB cream isn't quite enough. This is like a little bit more without being too much more. So you can use it for just like, I could just get rid of that there. You basically click it, like it's like a clicky, there you go. So I can just do that there and just dab it in. See, gone. Um, but the main thing I wanted to kind of get it for is just for when I'm a bit tired and I just want to do that. And just dab it in. So that is what it's for. And basically that lives in my bag along with the BB cream. So if I am going somewhere and I just, I'm like looking myself, I catch a glimpse of myself in the mirror and I'm like, ooh, okay, looking a bit rougher than I should. I can kind of add those two. That brings me on to my next product that I have been buying 
from Amazon. Again, this is a rebuy. This is something I've bought time and time again, but I use loads and loads. And it is this pack of pencil cases. Now this is a pack of 12 pencil cases. And I use these things for so much stuff. So I use them if I am putting makeup or anything into my bag, any creams, anything that could burst or go yucky. I use them if I've got to take the children's medication out. Again, so if anything was to burst in my bag, then it would just muck up the inside of the pencil case and not my whole handbag. I use them for work, for things like, um, in here I've got SD cards and things. So if I'm filming out and about, I need to take out spare batteries and things. I'm just sectioning off my bag. I use them for putting snacks in. I use them to put the children's crayons in, um, which obviously it's a pencil case, that's kind of what it's for. But you know, if we're going out and about, and I want to just put a few kind of pencil pencils into the bag to take with us if we're going out for lunch or something to keep them entertained. I use them for small toys for the children to section them off. Anything that you want to keep together that you don't want lost in the bottom abyss of your bag, then these pencil cases are great. And to be honest, I really like to keep them in stock because I just never know when I'm gonna need another one. But honestly, I cannot tell you the amount of things that these can be used for. The next item that I've bought on Amazon twice in the last couple of weeks, but I can't show you the actual ones I've bought because I've given them away as gifts. So I'm gonna show you the one that belongs to my children is a TV box. Now, I discovered these when the actual company, um, the TV box company sent them to me for my children to try. And I love them so much. I've bought them so many times for gifts since. Now, what these are, they're like travel boxes. You can hear them rattling because this is actually Bella's, it's full of stuff. Um, but I've bought these recently for friends, children. Um, and they are little travel boxes and you open them up like so and they can be used for so many different things. There is, you can use them for like Lego. This bit comes separately, so this gets stuck in. So you can use them for Lego, you can use them for lunch boxes. You can, this is obviously full of Lego, this is Bella's. But then actually sit in their laps so that they can play while you're kind of in small spaces. This has actually got an attachment that hooks onto the seat belt. So as it sits in their lap to play, while you're on a journey, they're good for when you're visiting relatives, especially people that don't have children, you have to take your own toys. We've taken them away with us, especially when we've been staying kind of in hotels or self-catering accommodation where we're gonna be spending a bit of time kind of relaxing, chillaxing. They can choose what to fill them with and they're just brilliant for traveling, for days out, anything. Love, love, love these. And like I said, I've, we had them already, but um, I have bought them twice recently for gifts and I will be buying them for gifts again and in fact the friends that I bought them uh, I bought them for friends children and they've immediately been out and bought them for their other children so they all have them because they all love them so much they come in loads of different colors and these as well as everything else in this video linked below my next recent Amazon purchase is this portable bed rail now the reason I bought this we've actually already got one of these on Zara's bed but uh, what ended up happening is last time we went away, we left it behind because obviously she needed it on her bed. Um, and we ended up going away and she didn't have a bed rail then when we got there and we had to pay to rent one, which seemed a bit insane because I think we needed to pay 20 pounds to rent it. And the this was about that price on Amazon. I can't remember the price off the top of my head, but I will link it below. And to be honest, prices change they fluctuate a little bit on Amazon don't they because they always give you kind of the best deal so um the prices can fluctuate within a few pence or pounds anyway but this was a good deal it was um I think I paid about 20 pounds for this um it is portable so it <laughs> it extends out as and then flops down the idea was that I could have this for next time we go away and just pack it because there's a lot to be said for being able to pack things in advance. I really hate when there's a whole load of things when you're going away that you cannot pack until the moment you are leaving, or like a bed guard, because you need them up until that moment. And you just end up forgetting things and leaving things behind. So I thought, as this was a pretty good price, I would pick one up. Um, when it's not being used, it just gets stored underneath her bed, and then when we are packing to go away, it can be packed immediately and will not get left behind again. They do them in different colors, 
um, and I just thought this was quite a good one, quite pleased with it. Pretty much the same one that Zara actually has in her room, in the house anyway. Um, if you've been following me on Instagram, which if you haven't, by the way, you should go and follow me on Instagram as soon as you've finished watching this video. If you have been following me on Instagram, you'll know that um, Zara has a be big bed in her own room. She's still mostly in the cot, but will occasionally sleep in the big bed. We're kind of not pushing it. She's happy enough in the cot, and if she's happy in the cot for now, that's great. But on the days where she's happy to sleep in the big bed, and more to the point, happy to stay in the big bed, the bed guard not only stops her falling out, but actually encourages her to stay in the bed anyway because there's just like a little gap at the end of the bed she can get out of. It feels a bit more enclosed, it feels a bit more like a cot, it feels more secure, she's more likely to be happy in it. So even if it's not just a safety thing about falling out because the bed's quite low, it is, it's sort of a nice way to help your little ones transition to a big bed. The next Amazon purchase that I've made recently is this chili bottle. Now I've got a few of these kind of insulated drink bottles. Um, I like to have them that I can kind of leave about the place because I always like to have lots of fluids to hand. Um, if you've seen my videos where I talk about how I kind of, what I eat and drink to stay in reasonable shape, then the one of my biggest kind of hacks, if you like, is just to drink loads and loads and loads. And in order to do that, you've got to have fluids to hand all the time. Um, so if you have got uh, something like this, which is an insulated bottle, I always have one with me when I'm driving in the car, when I'm working in the office, by the side of the bed. I have them with me wherever I am. And if I've got more than one, which I have now because I've bought some um, extras, then I'm, I've am i always got a drink to hand. And I always find that if you're drinking plenty, you're not going to end up overeating as much because it's so easy to confuse hunger with thirst. They come in loads of really pretty colours. Obviously, I picked a pink one because I kind of love pink, but they have um, a whole range of colours too. They're not cheap. These are about £20, but if you think about how much you would spend on buying like bottles of water and things out and about, which are not only expensive, but bad for the environment, it works out as quite a good investment. It can keep cold things cold and hot things hot. They also make kind of a nice stocking filler or the little gift for people if you're looking for bits and pieces if we're starting to think about Christmas. My next purchase was this pack of 10 beautiful bow hairbands for the girls. Um, I pick these up quite frequently. Um, they have them in lots of different colours. If you saw my recent Primark haul, which I shall link up here, you will know that I got some colours there, but they don't always have all of the range of colours that I kind of want or need in the shops um so this pack was quite good it was a pretty good deal um i will link again i will link this as well as everything else below so you can see um the exact price that you can pay on amazon at the moment this is a pack of 10 they are really lovely bright colors um and the girls wear these all the time they kind of finish off an outfit nicely I don't wear them, maybe I should start. Uh, but I know I always get so many questions about where do I get the girls' hairbands, they always look so cute. Um, and this is where I got 10 of them. <laughs> My next purchase was this. I know, you're all wondering, what is that? Now this is a pad that goes into the car seat um, for if your children have an accident at all, it's got a waterproof back, an absorbent bit here, so if your children have an accident in the car, then this will catch the worst of it under their bottom. Now, I've already had a few of these. If you've seen my potty training on the go essentials video, which I shall link up here, then you will know that I have had these before. I bought another one just because we needed an extra one for my husband's car. Um, and I also like to have spares because obviously if she does a wee-wee while we're out and one is wet, I need to replace it with a clean one until we get home to further protect the car seat because there is nothing more of a nightmare than having a urine-soaked car seat that you then have to take into the house and strip down because they're a real pain to do sometimes, especially when you've got the five-point harness. Um, and then you have no car seat because it's a carcass with urine-soaked stuff that's in the washing machine and you can't go anywhere. So these pads are a really good investment. They don't cost much at all. Um, and they just keep the car seat sort of clean and tidy. 
to the winner. My next recent Amazon purchase is something that my physio told me to buy. Now I'm getting some weird pain here which is to do with wrist placement and things when I'm working at the computer. So what I've got is this wrist support. So as I'm working on the keyboard, my wrists are leaning on there um, and that is stopping my holding my wrist at a funny angle which is then causing pain in my elbow by all accounts and it came in a pack with this which is a mouse pad um with a wrist thing as well so i've actually got um, a magic track pad um for my macbook which is like a separate one which again i was told to, be, to get because um i've got now the separate keyboard and things from my computer because of this kind of wrist placement causing back problems kind of thing i could do actually a whole video about kind of home office setup and the things i've got would that be of interest let me know in the comments if you'd like me to do that video I've got this it is a set of two i am liking it actually it's it feels lovely and squishy <laughs> um and it it is easing up i'm not kind of getting that referred pain since using these um it's just generally a lot more comfortable when i'm working for long periods of time so all in all i'm quite pleased with this purchase i have also bought a massive pack of pocket folders now honestly you just need to have these in stock at all times for when you've got to send things into school, for when things, important letters come home from school that have to kind of be kept together, you know, or there's a certain medical thing. Anything that needs to be kind of kept together and filed and kept neat and tidy goes in one of these in our house. Um, so, and there's all, my husband's always going, have you got a folder I can have? And yes, I have. I've got lots of them, thank you for asking, but, uh, if I did not have folders in stock ready to go then we'd end up in trouble so I do like to have these in stock I also like to keep one of these in the door of my car for when my children hand me important things from school that need to be put directly in there and I know that they need to kind of be dealt with or filed or whatever so these are linked below make sure you pick them up if you ever want to check out all the items that I recommend buying from Amazon, you can check the link below to my Amazon store. There's loads of ideas lists in there, lots of different essential items that I love and use every day, as well as gift ideas and ideas for traveling with children and all sorts of different products that I love and couldn't live without. Full disclosure, they are affiliate links and what that means is if you use the link to make a purchase through Amazon, then I make a small commission. And I'm always really grateful for when someone is buying something that I've recommended, if you use my link, then I make a small commission at no extra cost to you, as opposed to if you just Google it, then Amazon still charges you the same amount of money but doesn't give me any commission. Um, so I'm always grateful, as I started to say, when people do use my links because it's a way of people supporting my channel, helping me um, put out free content because this is my job um, and affiliate income is one way that I feed my family. <laughs> so yeah, I'm just always grateful when you actually use that link rather than just Googling it because it gives me a little bit of, you know, credit for spreading the word about the product. So yeah, just wanted to just briefly drop that in there as a quick thank you thank you so much for watching if you've liked this video please give it a huge thumbs up don't forget to subscribe hit the bell to be notified when i post new videos every tuesday thursday and sunday at 7 p.m if you want to watch more shop with me's and hauls they are down here and if you want to watch my latest video it's just over here see you guys soon